Terminal Run Recent Commands provides a visual interface for browsing through commands that have been run recently in VS Code's integrated terminal. You can use this to quickly re-execute one of those commands, so I could go here and select one of the commands to re-execute it, or you can just browse through the history, and it's a useful supplement to your shell's built-in history. Now to access it, you just want to run the Terminal Run Recent Command. Now to access this command, I'm first going to open up the command palette with Control Shift P or Command Shift P, and then say Run Recent, and I want Terminal Run Recent Command. This is going to show me all of the commands that have recently been executed. And then again, I can just click on one to execute it again. So if I want to execute this calc a command, I can just go and click on it, and that will be uh, executed down here in the terminal. Notice how if I run another command here, so I'll just run something simple like ls, that will now start being picked up by the run recent command. So now I have ls at the top of the list here in my list of recent commands. Probably not too helpful to uh, be able to re-execute re that, but it is providing a nice view of all the commands that I've run recently. Now this UI does provide a bit of extra functionality as well. So I could just start typing if I want to filter down the list. So if I want everything that has cow somewhere in it, I can just say cow. And now I have a list of just the uh, commands that have cow somewhere in the text by that uh, it's being filtered down now by that filter text. I can also go and insert the command without actually executing it. So let's say I want to run the cow say command here, but I actually want to modify it before executing it. Instead of clicking on it directly, I'm going to hold option or alt and then click on it. So now I've inserted the text here, and it's in, been inserted but not executed yet. I can go back and say, hello, fellow kids. And now when I execute this, the cow is saying, hello, fellow kids, instead of hello, fellow cows. One final thing I'll note here is that you can actually pin commands as well if you find that you want to re-execute them quite often. So I go, I'll say terminal run recent command here. And let's say that I really want the cow say command to be pinned because I'm running it quite often. I can just go and click the little pin icon next to it. And now it's going to show up at the top of the list whenever I have commands. So I can just quickly go in and select that right away. And now I have my cow say command being run very easily from that run recent command UI. Terminal run recent command can be a great supplement to your shell's built-in history. It does require enabling shell integration, but that should be the default now for most shells. So that's the terminal run recent command in VS Code.